I'm Dallas from the We Do Stuff podcast with another prediction or guess on a character from The Mass Singer Season 2. This time, I'm talking about The Fox. Uh, this one has was one of the hardest ones, at least for me so far, but uh, those are the ones I like. Some of them seem a lot easier, and I might wait on those or maybe not even do anything on them. But uh, this is what the fox said. Uh, said he's one of the most underestimated creatures in the entire animal kingdom. Uh, foxes are clever, strategic, and will eat almost anything. Um, he said it's perfect because this superhero is ready to devour the competition. Now, a uh, saying will eat anything and devouring the competition, uh, that gives me some idea that this person is uh, known for food. Uh, makes me think they are a foodie or something like that. But uh, a lot of people are thinking, uh, somewhat think it could be Grant Gustin who plays The Flash. Uh, I would like that because he is a superhero and his character has a very high me metabolism so he can eat a lot. But I think that's too on the nose for The Flash. I still don't know, uh, but there is some food related thing in there. He also says, uh, what does the fox say? Good luck figuring me out, because I plan on staying on my foxhole to the end of the competition. Uh, it's another play on the whole uh, fox idea. Um, maybe someone to do with Fox uh, Entertainment, the, the channel, uh, movies, uh, distribution and all things like that possibility but I was also thinking foxhole as in military and I could not find anyone who fit the uh, criteria of uh, being past the military and being uh, some sort of a superhero in any way shape or form uh, maybe I miss a voice actor that I haven't been able to find or something like that that I passed up but if you ask me I was thinking it was James Mardson. Now he is an actor most famous. The superhero he portrayed was Cyclops, Scott Summers, and the X-Men movie franchise. Uh, another reason why I think this is because the Fox had a glowing guy. It could be a nod to the Ruby Quartz uh, visor because his eyes uh, have this uh, photon-like this beam that shoots out, I don't know what it's called, but he emits this uh, ray that destroys things. So that could be a nod to that. And also the fox had a nose ring and the nose ring itself was in the shape of an X with a circle around it, like the X-Men uh, sign. So uh, that could be something. There was also a blue light on his costume. I couldn't figure out what that was. It was hard to try and look at. I wish I had some dif uh, high definition photos so I could figure something out. Sorry I'm rambling a whole lot, but uh, James has sung in uh, quite a few different things. A couple movies, um, most famously Hairspray, um, two other movies I can't remember what they are right now. The Fox also wears a top hat. I know it goes with the whole uh, steampunk idea, but it could also be a nod to his character in uh, Westworld. Uh, which is a really great show. Uh, People Sleep on the Second Season. I don't know. Other than him, um, Small Bit uh, goes for Grant Gustin and also uh, the guy uh, Colton Hayes who played um, Arsenal and Arrow. That's another person, but uh, I don't know the height of this person yet. So once we get information, I'll do an update video on him. Um, in a little bit, I have more videos about the other characters coming out. Um, if you think it could be uh, James, uh, give me a like. Uh, if not, uh, don't give me a thumbs down. Just put a little comment down below. Let me know who you think it is. Are you on the Grant Gustin bandwagon? Whatever's clever, just let me know. Um, subscribe, because I'll be having more stuff coming out about The Mass Singer and other things like that coming soon. Uh, take it easy. Peace.